Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Victoria 2 where we are playing Argentina. We are just uh, preparing to receive our huge batch of railroads which are being built pretty much everywhere. And we are gonna have a gunpowder factory in Los Rios. Damn, there's a lot of factories running around but most of them seem to be okay. Good for us. Uh, anyway, uh, our army is very strong, standing high, but we're having a bit of a budget problem. And I'm trying to simu stimulate, and s well, simulate in a way, uh, the influx of people into Los Rios, but they don't really seem to be interested. I don't know what the problem with the... Maybe the civilization level? No. Yeah, people from here are emigrating to the Resistencia, yeah, and I don't know why. Crop rotation, local education 10%. Local education 10%. Might be the Mafia? Maybe... Because we have no population there, I have no idea what the problem is. Let's just... Ignore it and <laughs> continue. It will sell itself. The population is increasing everywhere pretty much, so we are okay. We just need to get a bit more score to get into the civilized nation or into the upper cops of civilized nation, to be honest, uh, into the secondary power status. Upper house rearranged, more reactionaries, more conservatives, less socialists. More communists, less liberals, uh, more anarcho liberals, and more separatists. That is a bit. a bit sad, but okay. And there is still Spanish Peru. I wonder when it's gonna go away. Anything interesting? Ottoman version of Greek, Southern Macedonia, United Kingdom, and the Ottoman Empire against the Russian and Greece. Oman, death of the Sultan. Oh my god, what the hell is happening here? The Ottomans are completely occupied by Russia. Quran Greek Thessalia. Quran Greek Southern Macedonia. Oh, you're not doing good. Death of the Sultan. The death of the Said bin Sultan al Said has left him with two sons, each of which has claimed Oman as their own to rule. Uh -huh. The results of this struggle has brought in foreign mediation with the resulting decree that the nation will be split into two sultanates, one in Zanzibar and one in Muscat, each ruled by one of the al Said's son. Okay, so Zanzibar is now free and Oman is independent too. Are we still hemorrhaging money? Yeah we are. That's a bit of an issue. I don't want to increase the taxes anymore. Effective tax is pretty high already. Thinking the problem might be that we have too many soldiers really. If we get rid of some of them, it could help. We're paying how much free for these guys? Hmm. Uh, it should show. Yeah, free. Free for each. I think we have too many soldiers. Yeah, we're gonna stand these guys down. I'm gonna disband the third army and I'm gonna get rid of you. I'm gonna tone it down a bit on the soldiers. Which is not gonna help us with our rating, but we really don't have much of a choice, do we? Oh, yeah, that helped. That definitely helped. We dropped slightly, but that's okay, you know, it's not a problem. And we are finally having a leveled budget, so that's good. 
Better to have money than to have... Well, no, that's not true. <laughs> it's better to have a strong army than to have money, but uh, this will give us a bit more time to grow. Because our economy will only grow. We're getting a ton and ton of people coming in, and there really isn't any reason why we think that we won't be able to get slightly better in the future. Okay, more railroads being built. It will soon come, look at that. I think uh, railroads count in the industrial score. Factory in the total of goods output. Ah, okay. Goods output. So this will help. We have 12 now. So let's see how much we'll have when all of these railroads are finished. Yeah, budget is now okay. Diplomacy, how are we doing with... Okay, Empire of Brazil likes us. Paraguay probably hates our guts completely, so let's increase relations with them. Bolivia is our ally. What about Chile? Okay, they're now allied with Brazil. They kind of like us. Owns core provinces. Okay, yeah, I know. I know what your problem is. We still might want to get this province though. Sorno. I'd like to get this one. What is Colonial Chain? Oh my god, we'll have to get all of these provinces from them. And I don't want to get involved in another war, especially when they are now allied with Brazil. Though I think we might be able to take them, really. Crop rotation in Los Rios, good for us, and we got elections starting. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's helping much. I'm a bit sad about that. The production quota. State capitalism debated in Los Rios. Um, interventionism, state capitalism, Ludism. I don't even know what Ludism has in its probably no building of factories at all. Um, let's get we will deal with this. We will deal with it if the production quota becomes a problem. Actually, can we find someone with Ludism? Okay, interventionism, state capitalism. Moralism, plant economy, yeah, we have no one that would rather have Ludism as their economic policy. It's kind of weird. Anyone wants uh, upper house with Vodias, trinket, pension levels? Oh wait, there was uh, unemployment, trinket subsidies. Oh, no one wants that, really? Academic grants. Oh, I would love this. Massive endowment, prestige and research points increase, education efficiency increase. Well, that would be great. That would be great, but no such luck at this point. Are there are elections? Nice. Pacifist Surge. All they're saying is give peace a chance. Um, how many people are in favor of pacifism? Come on. Peace always prevails. No, let's go with the middle ground again. I'm fine with that. Okay, railroads are being... Yeah, look at that. The score is increasing. We are now at 12. Uh, I don't kind of... wondering why I don't feel here the railroads being built. It's weird. An inconvenient, inconvenient preacher. Let's credit the preacher and hopefully reduce the impact of his message. Now let's go with countering with a pro-war campaign. And what do we have here? Independent command. The old rules said that an officer breaking an order of a higher officer was to be brought to court-martial. This made decision-making very indecisive. At this point, regulations said that an officer was to carry on the core idea of the order of a superior officer, but how was at his own discretion. 
Yeah, we're getting more railroads, but uh, we're not really getting the sound of them being built. It's really weird. Uh, what now have full citizenship? We want people to be our citizens. Trouble in the tavern. Uh, just as demands a retrial. And we got state and government. National focus increased uh, by one, so we can have four now. War justification efficiency increased. Permanent prestige increased. That's good. And diplomatic influence increased. So now cheap iron would be great, but I'm thinking we might want to go with the collectivist theory. It would give us a lot of prestige possibilities, and prestige is really useful. Then we could maybe focus on the end. Oh, there's another one. Nationalism and imperialism. Don't we need this for something too? We can now get the passports. Okay, the demand on our government's immigration system has been immense. We must come up with a new ways to ensure that the rights of our new citizens are protected and recognized in the world. Okay. Of state and government increases prestige. Okay, definitely. Our state is changing, evolving from a single government of bureaucrats and despots to a true organism of the state. We march into a modern era, one where new ideas will transform the way we live. Tycoon capitalism and business. Oh, that gives. Yeah. Banda Oriental, United Plata, Vicar, Prohibition Law 1420. What do we need? Have social science. Okay. Sea power, merchant, these are avant garde, no, cooperative. Conquest of the desert. There was an, the open door. Nationalism and imperialism, which is the next one. Uh, yeah, so you know what? Let's go with collectivist theory and the nationalism and imperialism. Self-determination, manifest destiny, the dark continent. Colonial exploitation is probably good culture, but I like the immigrants. I like the immigration, so we're gonna go with this, that's gonna help with prestige. Then we're gonna go with nationalism and imperialism. Uh, which will be very costly, but good in the long run and then we're gonna yeah we need iron muzzle and this so we go with these two and then i guess we might do an entire industry level okay so collectivist theory it is oh wait we forgot about this so la pampa we need Capitalists here. Good, good, good. Everything is fine. Yep, capitalists are increasing, more railroads are being built, people are flocking in. Uh, the pen is mightier than the sword. Sure. Yeah, we need the progress here. We have crop rotation and local education, but we need the other things. The shaft mining and... Uh, that was one more. I'm not sure what it was called. Or is it... No, wait, that's just the shaft mining, right? Yeah, shaft mining. Damn, damn, damn. We need that. We need that. I think coal is... Top three exports. Top three imports sugar or and shoes. Huh. That's weird. Market activity. Population. Do we have coal here? See how much. Top five producers. Total 350. Oh my god, yeah, we really need more coal. 